and it's the tour, the list of names that people are watching. Hopefully I can move up that list towards the end of the race, but for now, I'm not, uh, not too worried about that. This is the moment, you gotta go. Come on, all in, man. So first of all, we have to be in position, we have to be sharp, we have to keep Derek out of trouble, we have to keep Pascal out of trouble. Go, man, Fudgy! Yeah, we, when I was a kid, we went every year camping in the Tour de France. So it was actually a family holiday. My parents and my two, or my brother and sister, trip one week in the, in the mountains and follow the Tour de France. I remember watching it on uh, the Outdoor Life Network every day when I, was, when I was a kid. I remember Carlos Sastre winning in 2008. That's probably some of my first memories. And of course, like the Lance days. Yeah, it was just always a pretty special race. I think day three is the first three one and from this day on, I look from day to day. What are you going with today? Sprint pressure? High speed pressure? 10 bar, yeah. 10 bar. Let's go. Waiting for the champion. And I prefer stages like this to have a hard one. And also today is super hard because it's 230 kilometer long, so it's warm. And it will be really hard finally then. You won't hear it in. Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's probably more about getting you guys just to remind you the roundabouts at 10k to go and then after, fuck, it's up to you guys. What, I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to add anything to the, to the communication, no? The riders, yeah. Of course, of course. I'll let you guys race because uh, I, can't, I can't tell you anything that's going to help. <laughs> Unluckily, um, they took the wheel off from G and he came to the ground. Christian was, uh, was trying to bring me back, but it was wasting too much energy for the sprint in the end. Yeah, I think I, I will be ready or I'm ready already and I just wait to come into the sprint and show what I can do. Come on, Pascal. Come on, come on. Come on, man. Final fucking 150. Come on. Come on. It's pretty cool to line up with these guys where there's no stage that is entirely on my shoulders, entirely on someone else's shoulders. It's every stage we're competitive in different ways. You know, the sprint stages we have Pascal, the break stages we have a ton of opportunity, you know, so yeah, it's just, it's going to be exciting to get uh, get into it. I have been asked it a lot and answered it a lot and I keep getting asked it, so I think people do think that that secretly I will go for GC and I understand it. I don't know that there's many people who have podiumed the Tour de France lead-up race that have then said, okay, well, I'm not going for GC at the Tour because it really was my first attempt at GC and, and my first big result. Um, but this is the tour. If you're going for GC at the tour, you, you work on that for a very, very long time. So, um, you know, maybe it's something for the future, but for now, uh, stick to the plan and try and win a stage. Yellow Jersey Group is done. The race is here. The race is here. That's it, Derek. That's it. That's it. That's it, Derek. Go get Steuven. This is the moment. You gotta go. Come on, all in, man. Come on, go get him. Just, just eight seconds. Just there in front. Got to time the right move, Derek. Time the right move. Five seconds. Five seconds. He's right there. Come on. Come on, Derek. Point to Derek. Come on. Come on, G. Yes. Fuck me, Derek. Come on, G. The fuck. Fuck. Yeah, you're empty. Job, Derek. You will win one this tour. Great effort, man. Yesterday, four, today, third. You are on the rise.
Honestly, when I was doing track was probably the farthest I thought I was from, from ever racing the Tour. You know, when you're a kid, you think for sure you're going to make it. And then you get farther into the sport, you realize how hard it is to actually go pro. And then from there, to make the Tour team is just another step. That was probably the farthest I was from, from believing that I would race the Tour. Not only did I get those results kind of with nothing before it and then nothing after it, you know, I think at the time, I had signed the longest contract in pro cycling with this team and it really felt like that category of riders who are offered a long contract is it's a very different caliber of rider than I saw myself as especially not repeating uh, the kind of performances that I saw at the Giro so there was definitely a lot of a lot of frustration but the motivation that comes with that over the winter and throughout the whole start of this year to to get back to to kind of those levels of what my breakthrough performance was. The Dauphiné was, uh, was a nice start and hopefully, uh, hopefully I can back that up again. It's not a lot really to talk about except wins and the final. It's really our day today, sprint day. We've been doing super well. Mr. Ackerman here, better every day, getting closer every day. Today's the money. Hey guys, so we're on it. This is now week two. A very warm welcome to stage 10. Yeah, I think the team did a really amazing job today. We, we were all together and Jakob kept us like 40 kilometer in front. The first left turn we did everything right. We were in front and then I could grab the wheel of Philipsen when he accelerated. He was just too strong. I like really hard races before and today was more about positioning and waiting, waiting, waiting. So I wait for the harder stages in the next days. Stage 12 is another opportunity for the sprinters, though there will be some sore legs in the peloton after yesterday's GC blockbuster. Uh, Pascal's our guy, as always. We have to do the race for him. It's our best shot to win. But it might not be as easy as uh, some... Well, it's never easy, we know that. No, it's up to you guys not to let 20 fucking men go down the road, okay? There are still too many teams interested no, in having a sprint. Uh, I don't think so. Top of the hill, we do our race. Come on, guys. All right, guys, stick to the plan, stay together, stick to the plan. Hang on, hang on. I was hoping Bahrain would just ride when they like, hit the print to stop the guys coming from behind. I was thinking in this moment to send you in front. Yeah, yeah. Because then Phil also has a right there. The but amazing shot, man. All right. Good day for us. Really good day for us. From the gun, we really need to be alert. We need to cover. We need to stay in control of the race by being on the front of the race. But if the race is like churning, like, 10 guys, 15 guys, you know, the race is basically out of control. We really need to be in. So first of all, we have to be in position. We have to be sharp. We have to keep Derek out of trouble. We have to keep Pascal out of trouble. And then as we go in the final, we can also pressure. Pascal's in shape, Derek's in shape. So you guys have to stay tight. We have to be in front. Make sense? All right, guys, good luck. All together, Peloton strung out. All together, one line. Straight away to the left turn for the one kilometer final. LA guys, LA, Stuart, LA. Come on, Aki, you're on the fucking green jersey wheel now. You're on the fucking right wheel today. Today is you. Come on. Come on. Come on, Aki. Fight. Come yes. on, Aki. Come on. Go. Come on, Ackerman. Fuck. Cats on third again. God damn it. What a fucking race. Man, oh man, what could What can we do more? Fuck me. Yeah, I think it was a really epic day. <laughs> I think afterwards the team did really such an amazing job today and 
I think we showed up, we are one of the best teams in the world, we are not just a second league team, so we act like uh, we are one of the best and I think we have a really nice team here and I'm proud of all of them. It's pretty special to be on this team because I think right now especially it's been kind of a culture that's been growing the last few years. Every race is just fun, you know, you're, you're every group of guys that, that you know, you line up with is just, it seems to, to gel well together and and the atmosphere is fantastic. It just makes it easier to race, makes it easier to, to work as a team, makes it easier to enjoy the time off the bike, and that makes you less stressed on the bike. It's just a really nice, uh, nice atmosphere that kind of builds on itself. Yeah. Yes, yes. Place. All right, good job, man. Ah, I mean, I was happy with how it, uh, how it ended up because I was hurting on the tourmalade already pretty bad. I was looking at this pretty big group and I thought I was in trouble today, but the guys were right and they kept me nice and sheltered until the last climb. And then just had to suffer it out. The guys that are around me in GC are gonna go. I just gotta pace it. Uh, lost them a little in the last couple hundred meters, but I'm happy with it. Ready to go. Last two uh, big days for Mr. G. He has three days, yeah. He has three, we have two. <laughs> yeah. The rest of the team has two. Um, yeah, I, obviously uh, Derek's earned the spot he's in in the Tour de France, you know, with your support. And, uh, it's all in for him today. It's really simple, simple tactic, nothing else to really consider, but uh, let's, let's keep Derek G in the top 10 and fight for the best best place they can in the Tour de France. All right, guys, good luck. Now, hey, Derek, you stick there, man. You stick there. This is your climb, your day now. You don't drop, you stay there. Jorgensen, the front. Hey Derek, LA, your day, man, your day. Rodriguez drop. Come on, man. You're going away from all your rivals. You're going away from them all, man. Come on. Man. Boy, Derek, got a boy all the way, all the way, man, all the way to the line. All the way. Come on, come on. Beautiful, Derek. Beautiful day for you. The show today where you belong to. IPT family, proud of you, man. So nice. Hard, but beautiful days ahead. Chapeau. Good job, Steve. Moving up. What are we front of Comisera? Yalla. That's what we wanted, man. Close, huh? Close <laughs> fucking day. Nah, no, not again. <laughs> Better for you. Great race, Dark G. Great race, man. Atta boy. Fantastic. You're the man. Great race, man. It's good. It's a TT. TT battle. Nice. Great race team. Great race team. Good luck, buddy. Have fun. Good job, buddy. Nice and slow, up to speed. Come on, really good, really good. Steady's off for a short period of time, then one last kick it to the top. Come on, finish line is over the top here. Really good there, really good. Come on, come on. Come on, attaboy, attaboy. Kick it up, kick it up, kick it up. Fast as fuck, boy. Come on, come on, drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it, drive it. 50 meters, come on, buddy, come on, buddy, come on. Everything you've got, everything you've got, everything. Fucking great, dog. So proud of you, man. So proud of you. Oh, <laughs> 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 
cares about a silly little TT? <laughs> I just didn't blow it. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's a pretty special feeling. Uh, I think it made the race extra stressful because I wasn't going for GC, and then I was in a good GC position, and then the objectives changed, and and oh, it's stressful every day, you know, especially when you have teammates, uh, when you have teammates you know, working for you and, and, you know, everyone putting in so much. And then, yeah, every day is, is nervous, but at the same time, it's so rewarding now to come away with the top 10. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad we went that route. You know, we, we had a, we, we've always been an aggressive team, been in the mix like every day with so many sprint stages. We, we really were aiming for a stage win. We did our best. We had tons of uh, great performances. So the secret to the tactic was for Derek not to lose time from the beginning. He said, oh, should I lose time and you know, then go for a break? I said, just don't lose time. Stay in the game, stay in the game, stay in the game. His athletic performance just came through. Like day, day in, day out, he rode a phenomenal race. To a top 10 performance, I mean, unbelievable. Really, really strong. It's pretty special to one day I'll be able to look back and say I went top 10 at the Tour. Yeah, that's an amazing, amazing thing that, that I think will stay with me forever.